Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Owen Harmonica. Today I'm going to show you one of my collection that is Super Chromonica Deluxe 270 and it's, this is the model. This model is actually an upgrade version of the Super Chromonica 270. So what is the difference between of these two models and we will go to find out later. Let's see. Okay, we have this Super Chromatica 270 Deluxe it with a case and then the case is inside the case is in black so this is the one 270 Deluxe Okay, now let's find out the weight on both harmonica for Super Chromatica let's check it out oh, it's 178 grams okay the total weight is 178 is about uh, one mobile phone weight for this deluxe version will it be heavier than the super chromonica let's see oh it's heavier it's heavier it's 14 gram heavier than the super chromonica and in terms of the design, you can see Super Chromatica 270 Deluxe. And the design is uh, different from the Super Chromatica 270, which is this. This is the Super Chromatica 270. Yep. But on the bottom, it's actually the same. On the bottom. We are using the same cover plate as you can see it's the same cover plate okay and then according to the website the mouthpiece is made by blast chrome plated and is rounded the hole is rounded so this is the original uh, super chrome car 270 is in square and this is round so this is the difference but both also have stroke means the pattern is same it's half stroke okay it's half strokes it's the same so beside what is the difference let's go into details Okay, I have opened it up and you can see inside there is a valve and also the replate with reeds. So we're going to measure the reeds. According to the website, uh, this uh, Super Chromonica 270 Deluxe is actually long stroke, which means the reeds is more longer than the original uh, Chromonica 270 so let's see let me see this is the uh, this is the F note so the F note the length is 1.45 the length is 1.45 so we measure this Original 270 Chromonica for this note. Uh, okay, you can see it's 1.132. 1.132 just sounds is 1.45. Now it's 1.32. So obviously, you can see the, the length of the uh, reads is more longer okay this is also another upgrade and the other upgrade is the old version of the 270 they used to have a new now they upgrade it to screw so it's more easy for you to do the maintenance 
So as you can see, the old harmonica is all in new. Yeah, they are using new to tighten it up. So it's not so easy to open it up and not easy to do the maintenance. But now they upgrade it into screw. So it's more easy to do maintenance. So let's see when we open it up the uh, the reed plates, what is the difference inside. Okay, I'm already unscrewed the, the, the screws. So they are totally uh, five screw on it. But com compared to the old versions, it have total 12 nail. And now it's um, simplified into five screw. So will it affect the result of the plane? I'm not sure. So let's see what is the different inside. Okay, now we took it out the reed plate. And this is the comb. It's made by pear wood. Okay, it's made by pear wood. So the, this is a chamber. So what is the difference between this and this? This is the original 270. So on the length itself, we can measure it out and let's see. Oh, okay. Now we can see on the top note. Okay, so you can see the last two holes. The chamber is lower. It's very obvious the chamber is lower. And you can see in the deluxe, Horner did drill deeper in the hole. Instead of uh, four straight away designs, and I think this is a little bit different. So let's measure. Let's measure it out. Okay. And actually, this is how many? 2.48. 2.48. And the same length for this. Okay, now this is 2.37, 2.37, so the length is a little bit shorter and then the design a little bit different and for the last two holes, this, the length is even shorter so that uh, you can control it better you have a better control on it because you don't have don't don't need so many air to push the notes so the last two notes is actually 1.81 1 1.81 1. 1. okay you can see this is the difference and the last two notes they have a they have grill Another hole. This is without without grill any hole. And the length here is shorter, here is longer. And the the other difference is this one. This is one. Another grill here. First four hole until uh, hole number five. But here is without any grill. Okay. Both also have the both chamber also have the RAM. It helps to uh, play better and well control. Okay, so let's check it out the, um, the thickness. So for the original two seven zero, the thickness is. Okay, this is one point two. One, one point two one. Okay, for the new versions, will it be the same? Okay, it's one point two three. Okay, just slightly thicker. Okay. 
and in terms of the mouthpiece we I'm going to open it up and let's compare okay I have unscrew the screw on the right and on the left so this is the mouthpiece it made by brass and chrome plated and this is the top plate top plate and this is the slide and this is the base plate okay okay for the 270 super chromonica and this is the mouthpiece let's see part by part so the mouthpiece here and with this mouthpiece the different is the design okay you can have a clear look looks rounded design and square design um actually when you play on it you can see it's very smooth the edges on the um, square design the edges is um, also not sharp but you can see on the round design the edge are very smooth okay you can see it very details every hole also very smooth okay this is the difference there's no different I think there's no different on the back still the same okay on this is the uh, uh, deluxe top plate and this is the 270 top plate both are the same no difference yeah there's no difference here okay let's see the slide okay this is the 270 slide and this is the deluxe slide nope both also same there are no difference same design same patterns same length okay it's the same both are the same okay let's see the base plate this is the deluxe base plate and this is the 270 base plate no in terms of uh, design no difference still the same both also the same same length same design okay there are no difference between them and in terms of the thickness of the replate let's measure okay let's measure do it right according to the website is 1.2 is 1.2 mm so is it correct 1.2 is correct it's 1.2 mm so and the chromonica replete thickness according to the website is 1.05 so that's the difference okay so for the maintenance actually this uh this uh comb is made by pear wood so for this part uh the things you need to uh really uh take care and really put an intention on it is the mouthpiece hole because this part when you open it up too often or too many times this screw holes were getting bigger and bigger and uh at the end you you will even couldn't uh screw it back on your mouthpiece so when you open it up please be careful on it okay this is the things you need to take care take note and for the comb right 
on the bottom is the deluxe and on the top is the two seven zeros so you can see you can see it on the first hole until hole number 10 hold no it's hole number nine it's almost the same we have just talked about this the the difference is the length and on hole number 10 11 and 12 you can see on the bottom right this part this part is thicker thicker than the original yeah you can see here the ram is higher there's no ram here on 11 and hole number 12 on the 270 deluxe they are ram on it so you don't have to put so many air blow so many air you can already push the note to sound okay okay now both harmonica put side by side same length okay same thickness same design and one is with horner printed logos and one is without okay same it's also the same it's just a little bit different on, on the color and here is the but there's the slide okay both also same okay now let's find out actually with those upgrade is it will have a different sounds the sound will be much much better let's figure it out okay now i'm going to play the 270 low octave and then we'll follow by the 270 deluxe low octave both recording also without any eq <laughs> you can hear the tone itself it don't have much difference and both harmonica almost very similar to each other on the tone on the low octave but in terms of playing feelings I feel that the deluxe version is much more smooth when you play when you blow and when you draw the notes so you can feel the air you push in and you draw out it's much more smoother than the uh, normal 270 that is the difference between them maybe the comb itself uh, does the good job um, because there's a little bit different on the angle on the chamber as you can see on, on, on the screen on this angle and maybe the angle makes the difference okay so let's move on to the me octave okay for the mid octave both harmonica the tone itself also not much difference and I, f I found out one uh, difference between them is that uh, for the 270 Deluxe, the tone is more solid. The tone is more solid, maybe because of the mm, mm, design itself, because uh, it used a screw to screw it up. So uh, in terms of tightness on the replay and the comb, 
this is more uh, tightened and less of air leaks so that it has the uh, a very solid tone on the mid octave so we let's see on the high octave For the high octave, I think you also can hear it uh, on the deluxe versions, it's much more easier to play it because uh, I think the, the comb design does help a lot on the playing feeling because you can see it in my video that I, I show you now, uh, actually uh, this design between both of them are really really different and the gap also different the length also different and the chamber are thicker than the 270 so this deluxe version design did help a lot on the playing control so i can feel that uh, on the deluxe i can control the uh, the air and the tone very easily so this is the big difference uh, the uh, on the high octave and now I'm going to play a duet song with both of these uh, harmonicas so that you can hear and actually both of them what is the difference between both of them if I play it together. Yes, after you hear both harmonica, uh, both actually also did a very good job and both tone are also very similar. But in terms of the design, the 270 will give you a long reach uh, and also a different design on the comb itself. So for the long reach, I feel that the tone will give you more solid and then uh, for the different design on the combs the 270 deluxe did a very good job so that you can control very good and very well on the playing and also on your tone so which one will you buy please comment thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel see you thank you wait a minute what i have just found let's open it up Oh my gosh, it's actually an aluminum comb for the Tustilman models and also a Deluxe 270 models and will it be different in terms of sounds and playable feelings? Let's check out my next video.